gentlemen. So let's go ahead and let's get started with do 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 our bell work. So we're gonna go to our third period class. We're gonna go to classwork. We're gonna go to do 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 do, do bell work Tuesday nine eighteen or nine eight. And then I've got the directions for what the different twos are. Hopefully you know what the different twos are. However, I see them used wrong like 24 seven. So I'm trying to like stress to you guys, that this is important for you to know. So two means the same as towards. You can place two with towards, then you most likely have used it correctly. Two means very or also. Replace two with either of those words to make sure you've used it correctly. And two with the number two. So we're looking only at the first sentence today. So sentence one, A. So it's gonna be A answers, and it's gonna be the first parenthesis. Often there are, what did you guys get? Two. All right, raise your hand for the first two. All right, raise your hand for the second two. All right, raise your hand for the third two. All right, so we went through the second two. And then next one, often there are too many people Raise your hand for the first two. Raise your hand for the second two. Raise your hand for the third two. All right, so we got the first two. Too many people to tell. So let's see if we can replace it. Often there are, let's see, very many people to toward tell a secret. So kind of makes sense. Let's see. Did that one... Did we get that one right? We did. So if you did that, you got that one 100% correct. All right, now comes the crazy stuff that we are going to be doing today. So if you remember, you have those in case questions that you guys had um, for kind of like bell work, or not bell work, for homework kind of that weren't really homework. Did anybody actually like write down answers for those? Okay, I'm gonna let you real quick on a piece of notebook paper. If anybody else wrote down, let me know. Uh, but I'm gonna let you write down those answers that you had written down on a piece of paper because we're gonna go through and we're gonna put them in the practice test today. So it's just a practice test, it doesn't count as a test grade. This is just us getting used to the testing platform. That's all this is. Um, I'm gonna use this as a replacement grade to my people at home. If you have them already done, go ahead and write them down on a piece of paper because we're going to be using a locked screen when we do this. So you will not be able to see anything else. So I'm going to give my people that are doing that just a minute. If you have not looked over the question, guys, this might be the time to look over those questions because we are about to like use it. We're about to do it. Good thing. So you want to look over, it is a thing called in-case homework. In-case homework. So if you go to stream, do, 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 do. Or, hold on, homework in-case questions. So and it was homework in-case questions, and it is these right here. So I'm going to give you guys probably about five minutes. It's 9.57. So at 10.02, we are going to move on. So if you already have them written down, down really quick, 1A, 2B, 3C, 4D, whatever it is. Um, if you have not, then go ahead and just peek over the questions for these three minutes. Just peek over them. You're familiar with them. If you don't know what a simile is, look at your notes. If you don't know what a metaphor is, look at your notes. So I'm letting you look at test questions before we take the test. So you guys better rock this test. Better rock it.
And you guys, in about two minutes, we're going to have to move on. So don't stress out. If you can get a chance to write down your answers, that's okay. You're going to get a chance to work on it today and a little bit tomorrow. So tomorrow, as you guys are doing this, um, it's going to be kind of our work, our makeup work day. So if you missed a test, you'll be able to take that test. If you couldn't log into the star diagnostic while I was gone, you can log into the star diagnostic. If you didn't finish the IXL, you can finish the IXL. If you didn't finish this, you'll get a chance to finish with this. So there, you'll have a whole bunch of things that you'll have the option to do tomorrow. Um, if you like, can show me you're finished with all that, or if I have a grade for you for all that, then you'll be good to like pretty much have a study hall class. So. Alrighty guys, so at this point I'm going to move on and I'm going to show you guys do, do, do what we are doing. Let's see, classwork. So, see if it posts it on your stream. Okay. So you're going to log out of your laptop. Don't do any of this yet. Let me go through all the directions. I'm going to show you some pictures, then I'm going to let you do it. So you're going to log out of your laptop. You are going to click the apps button at the bottom left, like we are state testing. So if you state tested last year, you remember there's that apps button on the like login screen. You're gonna click that and you're gonna click, I don't know if it's called clever or in case, but one of the two, you're gonna click login. Your login is gonna be your student number. So S blah, 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 blah. And then your password is gonna be Indian. So real quick. To do if you forgot how to do that, I also posted it here. Do to do. I also am going to show you guys this right here. So there's this S button. It's going to be either clever or in case, and it's going to be there. All right. If you forget what your username or password is, I have to set up right here on the board for you. But you can also ask me. I have your student numbers. I will gladly write down your student numbers. Everyone's password is going to be Indian. Anybody have any questions? Okay, that being said, go ahead and Ashley and, and Demillion, you guys are probably going to have to log out of Google Meet either way to do this. So go ahead, log out of Google, Google Meet and complete the in case. If you have any questions, you can ask it on the assignment for me. So guys, log out of those laptops, click the apps button, if anybody has trouble, let me know, because I need to know so I can help you. So your login is going to be your student number, and your password is going to be in the end. And your student number. Okay. So it's going to be in case or clever or something like that. If anybody needs a student number, let me know. I'll we'll get you that student number. What's the password again? India, all lowercase. Hit dashboard. 
was an error. Let me make sure it's on, guys. Let me make sure it's on. It may be doing the thing. Uh, okay, refresh it and try it now and see if that takes it. So hit log in again. Log back, log out, log back in, and it should work. So, see, mine for whatever reason was frozen, so that's what it was. So hit log out and then log back in. Steer, go ahead and take that test, guys. Okay, log in, log back in one more time. Just keep doing that. It is going to be. Oh, it's not showing. Log in, log back in one more time. Let me see. So, log in, log back in. So, guys, if it's not showing you anything or if the test isn't showing up, keep logging out and logging back in for me. Because that's the only way to like refresh it. I know that's really annoying. I should keep doing it. What have you done? It's like still ain't working. Do it. Do it again. Keep doing it. I know it's not fine. Because I've got some people that are able to log in and some people that aren't. So let me let me do this. Do it 20 times for me. 20. See if it shows up. It showed up for me. 20 times? Okay. That's all you have to do. You just had to log in and out 20 times. Let's, okay, I might have done it. You logged in how many? I, I got. I logged in there. Okay. Well, hopefully, when everybody else logs in, it'll be available. This is why we're doing this, guys, this is that we can troubleshoot so I can see what the issues are because this is how we're actually going to be testing from now on. So this is just a practice test. This is your replacement break. How come not you? What's this? Because we got rid of you. So we make a better break? Okay, so it's a replacement break. So if you make a bad grade, nothing happens. If you make a better grade, then an activity grade you've already done, it will replace it. Do it one more time. Log back in and log back out for me. Just keep doing it. So Ashlyn, I know there was some issues. Go ahead, log out of the test or the in case thing and log back in and see if it fixes it for you. Do it a few times because for whatever reason, it's having a hard time refreshing. So yeah, you're taking the assessment. If you don't finish it today, obviously that's totally fine. You will have more time tomorrow. You do bad on this, but just keep putting the grade book in the bad grade. Okay, I've already addressed that. But here's how it works it's a replacement grade. Okay. So if you have something that is a better grade already, nothing happens. If you have something that is a worse grade, this grade will replace it. Okay, so it can only help your grade. It's only activity grades, but it still will help.
When you're done, you are free to do something as long as it is silent and not distracting. And school appropriate. Don't be like silently splitting people off. Uh, that's not distracting at all.
All right, Ignis, uh, you have about 10 minutes left in class. Go ahead and start packing up. If you didn't finish, that's okay. I will give you time to finish later. So do not stress. Do not stress. Um, that we have done so far. What I'm going to do is have you click and say, yes, I've done this. Yes, I've done this. Yes, I've done this. If you click, yes, I've done this, and you have not done it, I'm putting you zero in. So if you're going to sit here and play games or whatever all day tomorrow, just know that if you have anything not done, a zero is going in the grade book. Not a one, you can replace it. A zero as in you cannot replace it. Be prepared. 